Australia is under new management and open, open for business. Young, uh, they're um, feisty. Uh, I think I can probably say have a bit of sex appeal. <laughs> and, uh, Big wigs from around the world are meant to be sitting down at these tables. There's Bang Bang from Indonesia. Next to him is Putin from Russia. And where's Tony? We are waiting for Prime Minister oh, Tony no. Abbott. <laughs> have a look at, have a look at oh. uh, Vladimir is going, hang on, where is this dude? Where is he? It what, took quite a while. They're having talks about it. Before we begin our discussion. chatting, he's not there, and then he comes in very, very late and uh, waddles over. And have a look at this. He looks um, like he uh, really, Tony, looks like he uh, doesn't really know what's going on. <laughs> I think he knew he was in trouble there. On the list of people I wouldn't keep waiting, Putin's just below <laughs> Kim Jong-un and just above my wife. He's probably got the horse out of the front ready to go. Do, do you get the feeling that Putin had a button that he was about to push and then he's like, oh, do I, do I, that made Tony actually fall under the table into a pit of sharks? Has anyone seen Tony? Mr. Abbott, Mr. Abbott, your chief of staff pleaded guilty this morning to a drink drive charge. How do you feel about that? Oh, I And he knows as much about business as you and I know about non-ferrous welding, let alone banking. said it was quite clear he knew absolutely nothing about banking. Well, I think the other thing, Tiki, that was very worrying as well is that there's been supposedly alleged impropriety. Oh, mm. now that is very bad news. What have you learned from the Christopher Pine disaster? Uh, well, everything to do with Christopher is great and brilliant. You know that, Neil. Yes. <laughs>